Gibbs the big engine. Rogers leads London. Who's right? Say, keep an eye on him. Write that name down. The city of Glendale. I'll, I'll do that just right here. Oh, for seven guys. He now has this put in just inside his own 22. Adele at that point. Just with the Nola goal program. Oh, the two main things that we're looking for. First touch from that. Hello rugby fans, I'm Dallin Stanford and welcome to the very first edition of a Raptors Weekly where we'll keep you up to date on the pride of rugby town USA, the Glendale Raptors. Today you'll see highlights from the Raptors home exhibition match, meet their coach and captain, check out the best Raptors features from on the pitch and online and then preview the upcoming Major League Rugby home opener. Let's begin with an impressive win over Nola Gold at Infinity Park. The Raptors Solid scored the Davies first three tries the of the match. Turns Campbell, Campbell, Campbell oh slices right through. Yeah. Fine here. Landry again, more was set. Bring it back. Nola will look to counter here. Glendale marching forward though. Well, has made a living here, Dan. And there it is again. This ball here for the Raptors. Picks up McGee. McGee floats one out wide now, Quill. Long lofted pass to Davidson. Davidson one on one. Davidson! He revs the big engine and Harley Davidson. Nola finally got on the board just before half time. Help, 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 help! Defense from Glendale. That was brother just quickly close. Glendale dotted down twice to put the match out of reach before Nola got their second five pointer. Ryberg right through the quadra set with eyeballs. Malifa's first touch almost gets five points. Davies quick hands. Diarchival out wide. Delboski the winger. Davidson now Davies. Malifa great pass. Great pass. Rogers through back inside. Quick ball. Quan Howden numbers flicks it out. Rambo. What can Johns do? Turns it back inside. Houston has Howden looming up. Oh, he'll love to get a try. The old home of Howden unselfishly back to Basca. That's beautiful stuff from Nola. The home side wrapped up the victory in the final minute of play. Dahl, open passes in front. Finds the Archibald flying through. Now Crusade, the footwork. Crusade, one step, two step. Breaks the tackle. Brilliant stuff from Mika Crusade. The Raptors also got wins over Utah Warriors and Nyack in the build-up to the season. Earlier this week, I had the chance to catch up with Raptors head coach Dave Williams to chat about the team's progress so far and their readiness for the start of the inaugural Major League Rugby campaign. Coach, let's talk about the preseason. How things gone for your side? It's gone really well. I mean, we, had, uh, we started in late January. We had all the Eagles who went away to the ARC. They started in the start of January to prepare them. So it's been it's been a pretty uh, like long preseason, but we've done really well. Obviously, won three games in preseason. Now we're really looking forward to that April twenty first game here against uh, against Austin. What, what are the team's goals for this inaugural season? I mean, the ultimate goal is to win the competition. Let's let's be honest. Uh, we're all competitive and we want to win. Uh, but it really is to improve on both sides of the ball. Make sure we go through our processes. Uh, not to be in too cliche, but we've got our own process we want to go through and our own team pattern. And the more we refine that and more efficient we are at that, then we'll obviously score more points and, and stop the team from scoring scoring points against us. Now you've got a ton of Eagles. We saw them carve it up in the America's Rugby Championship. You've got some former Eagles in the squad, but a lot of young players coming from the under-20 program. Who do we need to keep our eye on in 2018? I think Mika Cruz, uh, um, young Polynesian, outside centre in 12, uh, he's definitely one on the radar. Uh, he did phenomenally well against Utah, which everybody's seen on video. But, you know, his whole, when he came to the academy, he's definitely a standout performer. And that's why he's kind of like, not a graduate, but coming to come up and now as our senior academy kind of player. Harley Davidson, who came from Life University, he's a great guy on the right wing. Uh, he's like a human pinball. Uh, he does really well for us and uh, he's a great acquisition for us moving forward. So looking to that season opener, what do you expect from this Austin elite side? I mean, they're a big physical team. Obviously, they've got Peggy Wannenberg back in the back in the mix. They've brought in Andrew Sunula. Now he's uh, I know he's captain last weekend, so he'll probably bring that physicality and a bit kind of rugby knowledge to their back line. Uh, they've got a good ten. Uh, I know they're they're a little bit weak now with Pete Malcolm out for the season. Uh, unfortunate for him, so wish him all the best. Um, but you know they they they've had a bit of an up and down preseason, uh, but they're definitely looking to come here and then turn us over on our home ground. Well, we can't wait. All the best for that one. Thank you very much.
I also had the opportunity to speak with Raptors captain Sean Davies to get the scrum off's thoughts on leading the side in 2018. Sean, massive congratulations on being named captain for the season for the Raptors. What does the responsibility mean to you? Thank you, Dallin. I think um, the nice thing about Glendale is that we have a great leadership group. We have Zach Finoglio, who's been captain for the Raptors for the last, seems like, 10 years. You have Will McGee, you have John Quill, you have all these guys that have Eagles who have been around the block. So, I mean, for me, it's a really easy job, and I am grateful for it, but it's more just uh, making sure that the guys take one game at a time and just to keep the culture there and make sure that the guys stay in line. So, so right now, we have a great culture. The guys are working really hard. It's been a great great preseason, so we're all pretty up for it and yeah, excited for the season. And do you think this team is ready for the demands of professional rugby? Oh yeah, most definitely. I mean, as you can look around us, we Glendale's lucky enough to have the setup here already. So, I mean, we just have a new gym that got built that's fantastic. It's uh, You've got the stadium, the only rugby purpose stadium in the uh, USA. And uh, for the last couple of years, we've been working together as a team. So to answer your question, 100%, yes, I think we're ready for professional rugby. So on the field, what areas do you need to focus on to be successful this year? I think the big thing for us with Glendale is just taking it uh, one game at a time. Um, we have the physicality, we have the speed of play, we have the width we want to play with, but just taking it one game at a time and just focusing on the task at hand. You've had some preseason fixtures, you've got to see your squad in action, you've played NOLA, Utah and Nyack. Uh, what have you taken away from that? Um, the biggest thing for me and for a bunch of the guys is that we still have a long way to go. So we played some decent rugby against Utah, played some decent rugby against NOLA at times, and then Nyack we played some decent rugby there too, but we still haven't put a full 80 together yet. So um, we know we have a long way to go. We still have um, the two weeks leading up to that, or a week and a half now. So, I mean, we're all excited for, we're super excited for that first game, but we know we've got a long way to go still. So. Well, all the best to be cheering you on. Cheers. Thank you, Dan. Awesome. Really appreciate it. Cheers, buddy. Thanks. Our Raptors try of the week comes from the contest versus Nola Gold back in March and features a true team effort that was finished off by winger Harley Davidson. Into the 22 now. Keep working. Quick ball here for the Raptors. Picks up McGee. McGee floats one out wide now. Quill. Long lofted pass to Davidson. Davidson one on one. Davidson. He revs the big engine and Harley Davidson jots it down. Another try for the Raptors. The big hit of the week comes from a NOLA gold player, replacement lock Matt Workin, who bowled over a couple of Raptors defenders before losing the ball. Big hit from a big six foot seven lock on the charge. The legs, 110%. Pretty impressive. There you see the replay. Watch Cruze get quickly there. Secured possession. First the tackle by Blake Rogers, then Cruze came in and did well. You can follow the Raptors online by going to our Facebook page at Glendale Raptors Rugby. Our Twitter feed at Glendale Raptors. See fan and game photos on Instagram at Glendale Raptors. And if you want to watch highlights and other behind the scenes video on our YouTube channel at Glendale Raptors Rugby. Austin and Glendale have met in the recent past at Infinity Park before MLR began. Both are previous USA Rugby Division I champions and both have extensive fan bases in their respective cities. Here are some Glendale Raptors who are looking to make a big impact on April 21st in the MLR debut match. Captain Sean Davies is a live wire scrum off who runs the Glendale attack and leads from the front. The Raptors number nine is also a current US Eagle who played his college rugby at BYU. Davies might be the smallest player on the field, but he possesses the best pass of any player in America. Zach Fanolio is a Denver native who played at local high school powerhouse Regis Jesuit. The former US Eagle plays hooker and makes his physical presence known all over the pitch. They call him the Italian Stallion, and Fanolio is one of the crowd favorites on the field. Mika Cruz is a young star on the rise. He initially played for the Glendale Under-20 Academy side, but has now made the professional squad by showing off his speed and is a real danger with ball in hand. Expect to hear the commentary, what a try! It's not Mission Impossible. Harley Davidson is no stranger to high-level rugby, as he played with the Snake River Club in his hometown of Boise, Idaho and spent his college years at Life University. Harley Davidson, besides having one of the best names in the business, can round defensive players like Park Cars. Tickets to the season kickoff match on Saturday, April 21st are going fast, so don't delay. Purchase yours now at glendoraptors.com tickets. And make sure to arrive two hours early to experience the Raptors fan zone.
fan zone will have all kinds of rugby activities. Food trucks, beer from the Boggy Draw Brewery, a live DJ, plenty of pre-match fun for all, and your chance to meet the world famous Rudy the Raptor. Hello my sleek sensation. If you're not in the Denver area, you'll miss your chance to meet Rudy, but you can still watch the match live on CBS Sports Network at 3 p.m. Mountain Time. That'll do it for this week. We'll see you next time with full highlights and reaction from Glendale's clash against Austin Elite right here on Raptors Weekly.